Hey guys, hope y'all doing good today. Some exciting news, the Gourley testnet merge was successful for Ethereum. Now, for those who don't know what the Gourley testnet merge was, it's basically a trial run before Ethereum's actual merge, which, which is expected to be September 19th. Now, this is amazing because it basically says, hey, things are firing all cylinders for the Ethereum merge and everything is where it needs to be. Now, there's an article I'm gonna talk about exactly what happened for the Gourley testnet merge and then what the Ethereum merge mid-September will mean for Ethereum and its future. So first of all, looking at some key takeaways here for this article by Crypto Briefing, it says ETH was up almost 12% in 24 hours leading up to the Gourley merge. The Gourley merge represents the final trial run for the actual merge, which is expected to take place in September. And it says this was successfully executed today at around 145 UTC. The testnet merge, which saw the Gourley testnet merge with the Prater testnet, a proof of stake beacon chain, represents the final test run before the actual merge. And this is very, very good. It's very positive. Basically, kind of, this gets people really excited and what's creating a lot of bullishness in the crypto market right now. And it says, the merge has been called, quote, the most significant upgrade in the history of Ethereum. This advanced technical maneuver will see the current proof of work Ethereum mainnet merge with the proof of stake beacon chain, which currently runs parallel to the mainnet. Once the merge has taken place, the beacon chain proof of stake mechanism will effectively take over as the network's block production engine. Now, here's some big takeaways for the merge. It says, a successful merge has important long-term implications for Ethereum, including a predicted 99.9% .9 reduction in energy usage. Now, this is huge because again, remember when Elon Musk was buying Bitcoin uh, and he was bullish on it a couple of years ago. And then he said, hey, Tesla's not accepting Bitcoin anymore because it is not basically climate friendly, okay? Now, and that's been a big thing recently, basically people saying, hey, you know, crypto, there's a lot of mining involved and it's not friendly to the environment. Well, with Ethereum here, with the merge happening soon, it's gonna be a 99% reduction in energy usage, which is gonna create a lot more Web3 web applications to use it and a lot more adoption, a lot more investors to add to it. So that's gonna be huge. And I'm gonna talk about a couple benefits of the merge as well, in addition to the reduced energy usage. So there's an article here on forecast.news and it says, Ethereum merge will change the underlying way the network secures itself from proof of work to proof of stake. This is important since proof of work follows a similar mechanism as Bitcoin, where power hungry computers on the network compete with one another to validate and secure transactions, okay? So that's what proof of work is. Proof of stake, basically you're staking your Ethereum for a share of the rewards. And it also talks about, you know, the growth of NFTs, the growth of decentralized finance. Um, basically there's a huge rapid growth with Ethereum switching to proof of stake. And then, down here, it says the wide ranging applications of the merge. So it says the most obvious is that although other blockchains use proof of stake, Ethereum's successful adoption will offer proof of proof that an energy efficient and sustainable consensus mechanism can operate at a significant scale. This will likely fuel even more ambitious Web 3.0 projects to be built upon the network. Now, in addition to this, this is one of the big thing as well. There's technically a triple halvening, which means the merge will see new block rewards falling from 12,000 ETH per day to 1,280 ETH, creating more scarcity, limiting the issuance inflation of the token, and likely continuing to support Ethereum's value. And also, in addition to this, there's going to be faster transaction speeds, lower costs, basically a lot of the good things that you want to see on Ethereum with a mass coin that's being used by the people. Because again, Remember when Ethereum's gas fees were in the hundreds of dollars whenever NFTs and everything was booming? Well, hopefully after this merge, there's gonna be a lot less cost, a lot less gas fees, and we're gonna see a lot more throughput and faster transactions on the network. So there's a lot of excitement going on right now for Ethereum. You can see it right now with the price up over 11% to nearly $1,900. I believe it cracked 1,900 whenever the Gourley, or the Gourley merge was successful. So again, a lot, a lot of excitement now. I wanna caveat this with saying, hey, if you're in a lot of profit right now, recommend taking some off the table. You never know in crypto, things could turn on an instant. Again, you know, it could be another cash grab, but just always be careful. I can guarantee you crypto's gonna be volatile for the next month with, you know, the Ethereum merge coming up, people trying to, you know, buy the rumor, sell the news kind of thing. Um, a lot of stuff can happen. So again, always remember to secure profits on this bull run that we're having right now, whether it's a bear rally or an actual bull run starting. Uh, just be careful. That's one thing I wanna tell y'all. But hopefully y'all enjoy this video. Again, I try to provide as much useful info as I can. Uh, if you haven't already joined my Discord, I do have a Discord 
that is uh, has 815 people in it, free to join. And we talked about a lot of stuff. We were talking about this Gorley merge today. Basically, a lot of big things um, for updating and basically try to stay uh, stay up to date with the latest news as well as different altcoin chats, general chats, and everything like that. So big, big stuff going on in the Discord. Definitely join it. Links in the description and pinned in the comments. And I'll also link both of these articles as well. So if you enjoyed this video again, please give it a like. Please subscribe if you haven't. Really appreciate all my subscribers. Thank you guys so much for watching. Till next time.